Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. In this video, we will have a look at how to roll back a driver to a previous version in Windows 10 and Windows 11. Now, as I have mentioned previously, the latest and newest drivers may not perform as expected in some cases and may cause issues. So having the option to roll back to the previous driver uh, in most cases can resolve those issues. Now, in case you are unaware, we need to head to the device manager to restore the previous driver by using the rollback option. And once again, you can follow the steps in this video for both operating systems. Now, the simplest way to get to your device manager would be just to right click on your start menu, click on device manager. And in case you were unaware, this is where all the hardware is listed that is installed on your system. Now, I'm just going to use my Bluetooth um, as an example for this uh, video. Now, to roll back my Bluetooth driver, I would then just expand that, double click on that hardware, click on the driver tab, and here you'll see rollback driver. The description says, if the device fails after updating the driver, roll back to the previously installed driver, as I mentioned. You just click on the rollback driver tab. Windows then will proceed to roll your driver back to the previous version. And as I mentioned, in most cases, this can resolve um, those issues caused by the newer um, driver that you did install. And um, it also may ask you to restart your device after rolling back the driver. And, and if a, a, a restart isn't requested by Windows, I would suggest to restart your system anyway. Now, just another thing to take note of here. If I head to my display adapters and I click, double click on my display adapter and we head to the driver page once again in that menu. Yeah, you'll see that the rollback driver option is grayed out. There is no option to roll back to that previous uh, version of that driver. Now, there could be a couple of reasons um, if you are seeing this option grayed out. First of all, your computer has not had a previous driver installed for that device. And your computer did not retain the driver files from the original version installed. And then in my case, um, I have deleted and removed the driver package for my graphics adapter and I did that by using the um, uh, the storage sense utility and the disk cleanup utility. So in most cases, the reason you may not see this option to roll back um, is that you have actually deleted the device driver packages for that previous version by using a disk cleanup utility. So just take note of that. And um, that, as I say, is how you can roll back a driver um, in Windows 10 and 11, which I mentioned um, could resolve a lot of those issues caused by the newer driver version now i also i will also leave a link to a video i did post um uh, in the description where um i show how you can back up your drivers which is also another um good option and handy option as a good plan b so to speak um just to back up your drivers over and above having the option to roll back your driver and um, for your hardware and you can also use those um, driver backups um, to restore to a previous version. So then you have two options available. As an example, say your GPU adapter, you aren't happy with the latest or newer drivers. And then you have two options available where you can actually um, use the backup option or you can actually, as I mentioned in this video, you can roll back uh, to a previous driver version. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.